That's the fourth video where I'm diving deeper in explaining the buffet of interventions I'm offering as a coach within the 77 Days Next Level Business Challenge. So first of all, in the assessment, we need to make things smart. So I strongly recommend to work smart and not hard. Smart means you need to make the things specific, measurable, action-oriented, realistic, and timed. Right? You need to really know and assess what you want to change to operationalize it in time in order to be able to successfully change it. Another very distinctive feature is that I'm now 20 years working with the integral framework from Ken Wilber. In short, it's called AQUAL. The acronym stands for all quadrants, all levels, all lines, all states and all types of consciousness. It sounds a dash complex, but actually most of it you can learn easily in those 77 days. And with that, you get a strong competitive advantage because suddenly you can map everyday situations through the four quadrants, an individual interior, an individual exterior, a cultural quadrant and a systems quadrant. Also, you become aware of the different levels of consciousness of yourself and your clients. And the main framework there that we're going to use, it's called spiral dynamics. Another thing that you will become aware are the different lines of development. So you do not only have a cognitive development line, but a kinesthetic development line, an interpersonal development line, and so forth. So to become aware of those lines of development that are already properly developed, and the other ones that you need to have better focus on, really makes a hell lot of a difference. And then states of consciousness. I strongly recommend you train your states of consciousness because normally we're not aware of our state of consciousness and certainly meditation but also plant medicine and psychedelics, shamanic work are really powerful possibility to train your states of consciousness. And finally, typologies of consciousness. I have a certain character type as have you. So to become aware of the character type that you have with the endeavor that you want to be successful for as an entrepreneur makes sense. So that's all together the integral framework. And then we're also, I'm also offering the very basics like the business model canvas or how to, do you position yourself ahead of the bell curve. But also, I really strongly recommend that you take a very long time frame, a strategic time frame, because most people strongly overestimate what they can build in one year and strongly underestimate what they can build in 10 years. So I offer a framework which helps you craft a seven year plan. If it's a seven or an eight or a nine or a 10 year plan, doesn't make so much of a difference because your brain does not process time in a linear way, but in a logarithmic way. So what you don't do today, you don't do tomorrow, you usually postpone it for a week. What you don't po um, do in one week, you don't postpone for the week after, but usually a month after. So becoming aware of that pattern that you're not processing time linearly, but logarithmic logarithmically helps you to craft a strong North Star. Who do you want to be in five years time, seven years time, 10 years time? Make it shiny, make it bold, like make it as juicy as you wish to be. And then back cast and operationalize what you can realistically achieve in one year. And then even further down, cut it into what can you realistically achieve in those 77 days? And then what are the first steps to meaningfully achieving that? There's more to say around the buffet of interventions, but I don't want to make it too long of a video. So just check the landing page, alistairlanger.de slash business challenge, or show up in the Q&A July 29, and get to know me and just feel the vibe of, you know, what interests you and what are the interventions that you need one-on-one -on -one as well as in the peer group coaching setting.